Hey everybody, it's Shelly and this is a very important video about your data and Facebook, what they watch of what we do off of Facebook. So this is going to be longer than my normal video, so please do bear with it. It's important. I strongly encourage you to watch this whole video. So it's called Off Facebook Activity. And let me give you an overview and then I'll take you live and show you how to do this. Now I've included the steps up here. I'm not going to read them to you because I'm going to take you live. But basically you're going to go into this little drop down into your settings. And once you're in settings, you'll go to Facebook information and you'll select off Facebook activity. Once you select off Facebook activity, it'll ask you for your password. You'll have to log in, so make sure you have your password with you. And it'll show you what this means. It'll give you a description, what is off Facebook activity. It's basically, Facebook is tracking all the different websites we visit so that they can serve up ads that makes sense to us versus just random ads. So for example, if I were to go look at a shirt at Target or wherever, it'll see that I was interested in that particular shirt and then it'll be able to serve up ads based on that. So you can go in and you can manage that activity. You can even clear your entire history and disconnect so Facebook doesn't follow you, if you will, on your off Facebook activity. Now, when I went and looked at mine, I saw there were, holy moly, 744 apps and websites that shared activity with Facebook that I visited. Now, I haven't gone in yet to clean this up and clear it out because I wanted to show you this. Now, if you want to get information directly from Facebook on this, here's a bit.ly link that I created called on off Facebook activity. Just go to that link and you can watch what Facebook is sharing with us on that. So let me go ahead and show you how to find this. I'm going to go ahead to my home page on Facebook, which is where I am right now. You'll see the little drop down up at the right. I drop that down. I go into settings. And when I'm in settings on the left hand side, you'll see your Facebook information. When you click on that, you'll see something called off Facebook activity. You want to drill down and now it'll open up and let you know what is this mean. And it's, I had the screen capture there. It's basically Facebook is receiving all the information when you are off of Facebook on what websites you're going to, um, anything that you clicked on so that they can serve up ads that make sense for you. Now, some of you might not mind that, but you also want to know that you can go in to manage your activity by clicking there. And this is where you'll see the summary of what activity was shared with Facebook. And I was kind of blown away. Look at all that. I need to go in and clean that up. Now I can go in and clear the history right here. I can download my information, manage future activity, etc. Just make sure you go in and take care of this because to me, this is incredibly important on what is happening um, with what they're doing with your Facebook activity. So let me go back and show you. We were in manage. We can also go clear history, which again, I'm not going to do right now, but it will disconnect you from all of Facebook's tracking of your history in your account. So check it out. I know this is a little bit longer than my normal video, but I think this is very, very important for you to go see and take care of. Um, and if you need to get a hold of me for any reason, the best way is email sroth at shellyroth.com. I'm not sure what happened there. Um, and go to shellyroth.com and see what's coming up on the calendar. If you happen to be in Houston, I also do webinars and custom content for businesses. So give me a shout. Have a great weekend and we'll see you next time.